We're finally putting on this NVIDIA Catalyst downpipe. I was gonna put on this uppipe today, but the studs are still in here and I don't have a torch to go ahead and uh, burn them out. I was gonna try the two nut method, but honestly, these are too short and a little bit too far for me to try anything. So we're just gonna do the downpipe today and uh, yeah. I'm really excited to see how it sounds and uh, see how it performs. I don't know how much like horsepower it's gonna add. Um, I'm just doing the OTS tunes right now until I can get a custom tune. Probably gonna go to Matt Miner if you guys don't know who that is. He's like infamous for tuning Subarus around here. All right, so first thing you're gonna wanna do is to take off the top mount, and it's the same process that I showed you guys in the uh, pitch stop mount video. You just take off the bypass valve, and then you take off these two nuts on the side, and it pops right off. Oh, forgot to mention, you're gonna wanna unscrew these, the, the little little coupler pieces, and then boom, it'll pop right off. Just unscrewing the little uh, little coupler piece, and all right, let's move. Whoa, wow! <laughs> oh no, oh man. Oh, that's really in there. Got it, got it, got it. There we go. Whew, that was scary. And there we go, yay. Yep. Only took like 10 minutes. AOS is doing its job. There is no uh, no oil in here. Basically now we're just taking off the two bolts that go from the actual downpipe to the cat. Um, I mentioned before, I have a turbo excess cat back on here, three inch all the way back. Um, I'm definitely gonna change that to either NVIDIA or Tolmate later down the line. I'm not really too sure which one, but boom, 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 boom. Yay! Oh That's my god, done. that's gross. Yeah, wait, let me take this off. Alright, good. Now we have to take that big bolt off. Yep. Okay. Careful of the jack. Oh, I keep forgetting about that thing, man. It's not like it's important or anything, it's just a jack. <laughs> <laughs> like it's like kind of determines that like I'll put it on there for you. Who needs there a wife? You should have it on off setting, Jacob. I hope. Let me see. Let me... Come out. There, there we go. All right. Last part is just the heat shield now. Oh, Little no bolts I didn't get. These ones. Would you believe me if I told you we did this whole thing without any type of penetrating fluid? No PB blaster, no WD-40. And knock on air because wood burns, but so far everything is kind of just coming right out. Um, except for this heat shield, that's that, that's why it's still in the way. It, we're just we're just working with the heat shield in the way. Shout out to the main man David. You guys remember him from the uh, valve cover video? Yo. And also H two O when I said okay, David. When you did two <laughs> step right behind Leandro right before we got arrested. Yeah. <laughs> he has a rough right now. I can see that. Yeah. Yeah. He, ow, yeah. He does. This should, this should come off. It's about to. Yep. Yes, hold that. Yeah. Good. All that Oops. rust. Right. I'm just gonna drive right into the engine so that my fine knock learn can pick it up later. Alright, boom. Yay! Right. Told you it's doable. Oh shit. Well, almost dropped Falls that. it falls. Right. <laughs> Bro, it's just a stud. Once you break it, you can zap it off with that. Told you we'll get it off today. I'm so scared, guys. Well, there's nothing to be afraid of. I do this all the time. This right now probably comes off at least like twice a month. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I'd be working on it. Yeah, well, this is the last one. And then it's gonna come off. Yeah, the last bolt. Literally like my car. That bolt down there that was giving us literally a world of problems right there. Finally got it off. We just had to use a uh, massive breaker bar for it. We just gotta get that off. We're gonna uh, unplug the L2 sensor and then this should come right off. Literally, this, well, this would destroy this plastic car right here. That's it. Literally take off this plastic car. And then you're done. Oh, it's a fucking zip tie, dude. That's what that is? I think so. Go annihilate it. Wait, wait, wait. He's just taking the clip off. Be careful. Yeah, go crazy. Go crazy. When I say go crazy, there you go. That's it. All right, now you can take it off. It's completely off now. It's on the ground. What's We're just trying to uh, snake it out. What's it stuck on? It's attached. You said attached to it. Oh, wait. I can, I can see it. Literally rest it out. Yep. Go ahead. It's literally just hanging right now. You know, this is this is the this is the downside of trying to modify cars on the East Coast. Everything's so rusty, man. Coming down. Has that gasket looked? 
Does it look still reusable? Well, it's a good thing I'm not reusing it. <laughs> Let's pull this ugly thing out. It's stuck on the oh. I think it's down here, David. Yeah. Brush it with a time, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, weight reduction, bro. Yo, this is so heavy compared to that, bro. I literally can't pick that up. Compared to this, which literally weighs like two pounds. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is awesome. It's kind of hard to record while we're working and stuff, so just bear with us. But oh, I'm so excited. All right, guys, so it's done. Uh, I saw, sorry that I didn't record everything. It got dark, and then we tried to just put everything on super quick, so we did. Um, we're going to load the stage two soon. Now I'm doing a low wastegate map just because I don't have a three-port boost controller. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the sound clip. I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'm really excited to hear how this damn thing sounds. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared.
our stuff. And that's, you know, that's where we are now. I just, I just think it's kind of cool to like see like growth. And I feel like I'm proud of my growth as like just a person. And also like in this whole YouTube thing, it's pretty cool. I know this channel is pretty slow going right now, but like it's, it's growing steadily and organically and that's what I want. So uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys watching my videos and I hope that uh, you guys stick around because this is gonna be an awesome build. And I can't wait to, God damn, that's bright. I can't wait to make this car something literally unrecognizable, so.